Hey my loves, welcome back to another video. This is just a little mini video today because it's something that I realized recently and I wanted to bring your attention to it. And I want you to know what to look out for when you are innocently scrolling social media. And especially if you have young sisters or young daughters or young anybody who is impressionable to what they see on social media, please show this to them so they know what to look for. There's a new sneaky way that celebrities and influencer models are, shall we say, altering the way their bodily proportions look in their photos and videos and they can't even be quite caught out for it. This, my friends, is what's known as lens distortion. And lens distortion is not the same as face tuning or photoshopping or editing your pictures, technically speaking, but it will absolutely change the way your body looks in photos and videos to an epic degree. In this way, influencers and celebrities and models don't even have to actually resort to using editing apps like Facetune or face app or Photoshop, the camera is actually manipulating their images and their body for them. As you'll see in this video, simple lens distortion can make your body look like it belongs to a totally different person. So what the heck is lens distortion and how do you know what to look out for? Lens distortion is a photographic technique that alters the bodily proportions of subjects in images and videos. Lens distortion utilizes lens curvature, focal length, and camera angle to alter the way a person looks in the photo. Lens distortion can create the illusion of slimmer bodies and emphasize desirable features and downplay aspects that don't conform to our current beauty standards. So who is utilizing the benefits of lens distortion? Ariana Grande for one, she is terrible for it. Look at these pictures that Ariana posts to her Instagram. These pictures actually really piss me off because it just takes me back to Tumblr 2010 vibes where thin spo was all the rage. Like common sense would tell us that Ariana's feet probably aren't that much bigger than her knees, but the way she's posing and the way in which the lens is making her look makes her look like her body is teeny teeny tiny like pocket sized and yet her extremities like her hands and her feet are huge. Technically she is not editing her pictures, she's not face tuning, she's not photoshopping or anything like that but the way the lens is distorting her bodily proportions is totally unlike how Ariana actually looks in real life. This is paparazzi pictures of Ariana in real life. And as you can see, in real life, her bodily proportions are very human. In pictures like this, she looks more alien. Utilizing lens distortion to this degree makes your legs look super long, super thin, your waist look teeny tiny, and your head look big in comparison. And we all know that if we were looking at Ariana, for example, in real life, her head would not be this much bigger than the rest of her body. The rest of her body would not be this tiny in comparison to her head. But the way the lens is distorting Ariana's bodily proportions is making it look like she is much smaller and much thinner than she actually is in real life. Another one who's really bad for lens distortion, whether she knows it or not, like this could be a photographer who is doing this without the celebrity or influencer knowing and they just happen to like the picture and therefore they post it. But another one who's very fond of the old lens distortion would be Dua Lipa. If you have a flick through Dua's Instagram, you will be greeted with so many images where the bodily proportions of the Instagram picture look very, very different to her bodily proportions in real life in which she looks very human, very normal, but then in the Instagram pictures. The lens has distorted her body in such a way that again, her head looks huge in comparison to like her legs and her waist and her hands and her feet are also bigger than the rest of her body. Lens distortion makes Dua's waist look teeny tiny, whereas in real life, it is just a normal size waist. It also makes Dua's legs look triple the length of what they are in real life and her feet look two times the size of her head. If that were the case, I feel like it would be very, very hard to find shoes in her size. So I don't think this is quite realistic. For example, look at this picture here where she's wearing this really cute butterfly dress. The lens is distorting her bodily proportions in that her waist looks barely any bigger than her head and her feet look huge in comparison. Then if you look at paparazzi pictures where she's not posing, she's not got lens distortion, you can see that in real life, her bodily proportions are very bloody different. Her waist is bigger than her head, which is to be expected. Now, although technically speaking, utilizing the benefits of lens distortion and angles is not necessarily editing your body. But in my opinion, it's perhaps even more sneaky because you know that you can't be called out for it and you can't actually be technically accused of altering your body for photos. And yet in a sense, that is precisely what you're doing. In my opinion, it's incredibly disingenuous, especially if you know what you're doing and you know that in real life, your body actually doesn't look like that at all and that your bodily proportions are significantly different to how the lens distorts you. And this is just another reason why we need to be so mindful of the content that we are consuming on social media and Instagram and TikTok in particular, especially if you do suffer with body image issues. Looking at this kind of content, it looks so real. Like you can't see palm trees bending in the background. It's not obvious that it's being tweaked because technically, speaking, it hasn't been tweaked. And yet this is not a real life image that you're viewing. This is not actually what these people look like in real life. 
Elsa Hosk is another influencer and model whose Instagram is pretty chock-a-block full of lens distortion. Now, obviously, she's a professional model, so she knows her ankles and she is clearly a stunning woman, but it's definitely something we should all be aware of when scrolling social media. Lens distortion, whilst not overtly editing your body in pictures, is still distorting what these people's bodies really look like. It's so important to be aware of these photographic tricks when consuming social media so you don't end up comparing your real-life body to lens distorted perfection. So what on earth are these celebrities and influencers using in order to create images like this for their social media? Well, honestly, it could be quite a few factors, but the main culprits would be a wide angle lens. This is known for its ability to capture more of the scene, which makes them popular for landscapes and architectural photography. However, when used for portrait photography at close distances, their distortion characteristics can be used intentionally or inadvertently to alter the proportions of the subject, creating the illusion of a slim appearance. While wide angle lenses can create a slimming effect, they also can exaggerate features, listen to this, that are closer to the edges of the frame, potentially distorting the facial features if not used carefully, hence the large feet and hands you see in these pictures. There's also another lens called a telephoto lens that can also have the same effect in making the subject look much taller and longer and thinner than they actually appear in real life. Now you may be sitting here watching this video thinking like, Steph, big whoop, someone's using lens distortion. Who cares? Problem is, is when huge influencers and celebrities with millions upon millions of young female followers intentionally or unintentionally use lens distortion to alter the way their bodies look in photos and videos. There are, in actual fact, pretty bloody big ramifications from posting images like this. According to research, the psychological implications that can occur from viewing photos that utilize lens distortion can include distorted perceptions of your own body, constant exposure to the ideal body image achieved through lens distortion and other digital manipulation can contribute to feelings of inadequacy, low self-esteem, and body dysmorphia. Though utilizing the benefits of lens distortion isn't technically face tuning or editing or photoshopping your pictures, through its subtle manipulation of your bodily proportions, lens distortion is absolutely problematic in that it perpetuates these unrealistic beauty standards that nobody can actually uphold. I know this is just a little mini bonus video, but I think it's important that when we are scrolling social media, we are aware of what we're looking at and the techniques used to create these picture perfect bodies and images so that we can navigate these beauty standards and the social media perfectionism with a discerning eye and not fall victim to it.